gather together in this time in order to offer ourselves up in prayer. We know that gathering is not looking the way that it has in the past. And so we set aside a space and a time that we can be in prayer together each week. And we hope that as you listen to this, you are offering yourself time, not only today, but throughout your week to engage in the important act of prayer, connecting with God, connecting with your feelings, and sharing all of that that weighs on your hearts and your minds each and every week with God. We know that there are so many who are continuing to suffer from the wildfires that spread across our country, and so we lift up all those who have lost their homes, lost their livelihoods, been evacuated, or are living in fear of what is coming in the next few days. And we hope that they are held in the comfort, strength, and love of God's continuous love. Praise you, Creator God, in whom we live and move and have our being. We join all in creation in worship as the trees lift their branches and begin to lose their leaves. The sky reveals your changing glory and the birds find warmth. As we gather today, help us remember the rhythm of the seasons that often calls us to rest as our internal work is done. We praise you for your son, Jesus Christ, who proclaimed the message of your love, who brought healing to the brokenhearted, relief to the fevered, peace to the hunted, and wholeness to the wounded. As we gather today, help us to remember the hope we have in our Savior that invites us to pray for one another. We praise you for your Holy Spirit, who draws us to this common place. Your Spirit moves in and among your gathered people, opening bleary eyes, comforting the grieving hearts, and challenging us to be partners in God's work. As we gather today, help us to be strengthened and renewed so that we might serve you, Creator, Christ, Holy Spirit. And so we share together the words that Jesus taught us to pray. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever. 